Okay, so today we are going to add GUI support for Docker and ROS uh, working together so we can do things like use uh, RVIS2 or Gazebo. So we're going to do that through a tool known as Rocker. What is Rocker? Uh, Rocker is a tool that in short helps support uh, making Docker containers uh, for all things ROS. And so really at its core is it helps um, when the local environment, well, the container is significantly impacted, right, by what's going on in the local environment. So X using X11, aka using uh, a GUI or desktop interface or, or using graphics drivers, um, audio, um, those things, right, can get a bit complicated and troublesome with Docker. So Rocker takes care of a lot of that for us. So the way that we can install Rocker um, is simply through um, the app package manager. I already have it installed, so no secret sauce uh, there. So app get installed. Um, if you are not on a Debian-based uh, machine, uh, you can install it through pip. I'm not sure if this is going to work on Windows or not if you're a Windows user. Um, but you can also install through pip and see what happens. So let's look at a really quick example. So if I wanted to run uh, ROS2 Umble uh, and get the desktop full so it has Arviz, um, and I want to be able to actually view what's going on with Arviz, I use, uh, I call Rocker with an ex the extension X11. So extensions are the core of Rocker. So the, the different extensions for uh, X11 graphic support, audio support, right? So you add the extension and bam, we run the container. We are in it. And so now I can say Arviz2 and we're up and running with no issues. So um, if I want to now um, <coughs> mount or um, add NVIDIA support, um, all I do is I run that same command with the NVIDIA extension. And now we are all good in the hood today. Uh, and Rocker also makes it pretty easy to mount containers, I mean, mount uh, volumes. So if I want to mount my trusty, dusty development directory where all my code is stored, I just do tech tech volume and the directory that I want to mount. And so if I go home, I will see the uh, directory that I want it to mount. So that is a very quick um, overview of using Rocker. And if you're doing anything with uh, NVIDIA, you want to check what uh, drivers are compatible with Rocker at this time. So for instance, at the time of this recording, uh, you know, we have specific drivers that work with specific uh, Ubuntu distributions. And obviously you need to make sure that NVIDIA Docker 2 is installed uh, is installed first, and so uh, if you if you're going to do that, you simply go through uh, this guide here. So that concludes our overview of how to use uh, how to get uh, GUI with Rocker.